Thank you. Well, an Iowa couple started selling corn in Carlisle back in the 1990s. Here's Local 5's Connor O'Neill sharing Mike Penick and his wife Tracy's sweet story. Mike and Tracy Penick have been selling corn at their pop-up since the 1990s, and their story is just sweet. Um, we started it so that our two girls, which they were little girls at that point, um, it was going to be their college fund. Their two daughters, Stephanie and Courtney, pictured here, have now graduated college. It helped with a little of their expenses. And Iowans loved seeing Mike and Tracy's then young daughters helping out so much, a few customers wouldn't buy corn unless Stephanie and Courtney were there. They said, we're only buying corn from you if the money goes to the girls. It was important that all the money went to the girls or people wouldn't buy. Now that their daughters have moved on, Mike and Tracy continue to run their pop-up stand and their farm and both continue to grow. Now we're up to about 37 acres, so we've increased it a little bit. Increase from one acre of land dedicated to sweet corn many years ago. And that was around the same time the Phoenix transitioned their focus in farming. We got out of the livestock business and made it a full-time business for the summer then. Yeah. Now approaching retirement age, the Phoenix don't plan to quit selling what they love. We just like selling sweet corn. It's just, it's become a tradition with us now, even though we're getting harder every day now to get up at early of the morning and pick it. Corn's so big in the Phoenix family, their grandchildren also help and come out and pick at the farm now. Reporting in Carlisle, Connor O'Neill, Local 5 News, We Are Iowa. And if you want to check out the Phoenix Sweet Corn Stand, they are off of Highway 65 and 69 near Indianola. Mike also has a spot at the Des Moines Farmers Market on Saturdays where he has been selling his sweet corn for over 25 years. Incredible story that they've got going on there.